Adding and subtracting time. Adding. Let's try an example. First, we need to add these two numbers, 27 plus 18, because the units match. 7 plus 8 equals 15. We are going to write 5. Carry over the 1, and then we need to add 1 plus 2 plus 1, which equals 4. So we have 45 minutes. Now we need to add the hours column. 3 plus 2 equals 5 hours. So the answer is 5 hours and 45 minutes. Let's try another example. 5 plus 8 equals 13. So we need to write the 3, carry over the 1, and then we need to add 1 plus 2 plus 4, which equals 7. So we have 73 minutes. Now we need to add the hours column. 2 plus 1 equals 3 hours. So we have 3 hours and 73 minutes. Keep in mind that 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. We need to take away 60 minutes from 73 minutes and give it to the hours. That gives us 4 hours and 13 minutes. Let's try another one. 9 plus 7 equals 16. So we need to write the 6, carry over the 1, and then we need to add 1 plus 3 plus 4, which equals 8. So we have 86 minutes. Now we need to add the hours column. 5 plus 7 equals 12 hours. So we have 12 hours and 86 minutes. 86 exceeds 60 minutes, so we need to regroup these 86 minutes into 1 hour and 26 minutes. We take away 60 minutes from 86 minutes and give it to the hours. Now we have 13 hours and 26 minutes. Subtracting. Let's try an example. The numbers on the top are bigger than the numbers on the bottom. Because of that, we can subtract 23 from 48 normally. 8 minus 3 gives us 5, and 4 minus 2 gives us 2. So we have 25 minutes. We are going to do the same thing for the hours. 6 minus 2 equals 4 hours. So the answer is 4 hours and 25 minutes. Let's try another example. Take a look at the minutes. We can see that the number of minutes at the top is smaller than the number at the bottom, so we have to borrow an hour to make this number bigger. We cross out 14 hours and make it 13 hours. Instead of carrying one hour, we carry 60 minutes, because there are 60 minutes in one hour. 60 plus 23 becomes 83 minutes. Now we can subtract 47 from 83. It is 36 minutes. 13 hours minus 9 hours equals 4 hours. So the answer is 4 hours and 36 minutes. Let's try another example. Take a look at the minutes. Because 33 is smaller than 45, and we can't subtract 45 from 33, we need to borrow an hour. We had 9 hours and now we have 8 hours. Instead of carrying 1 hour, we carry 60 minutes, because there are 60 minutes in 1 hour. 60 plus 33 becomes 93 minutes. Now we can subtract 45 from 93. It is 48 minutes. 8 hours minus 2 hours is 6 hours. So the answer is 6 hours and 48 minutes. If this video was helpful, please leave a like. For more videos like this, please subscribe.